speaking of mild, all winter long, it's been pretty mild. We haven't seen much snow or cold. The 19 first alert weather team, we're breaking down why winter's been so mild and what's to come for the rest of the season. Here's meteorologist Erica Page with details on why there's been a lack of snow so far this season. You know, it really has been a season where we haven't seen a lot of snowfall. We have seen a lot more of those warmer temperatures across the area. And a lot of it has to do with the weather pattern that we've been seeing here across Northeast Ohio. So I want to bring out our reality graphics and really just show you where this pattern has set up to bring us more of this warmer weather. So if you take a look across the country as we bring it up, you'll see that we've had a lot of that colder air basically parked out to the west. It's all due to the jet stream. The jet that stream has stayed farther to the west, dipping into the south, but then allowing all of that warm air to really bring us those warmer temperatures across northeast Ohio over the past couple of months. Yes, we've gotten a few shots of that colder air trying to mix in, but it hasn't been significant enough to bring us those prolonged days of really cold temperatures. And in fact, if you look behind me, you can see there's no ice coverage across Lake Erie as we're out here on Edgewater Beach. In fact, less than 1% as we were looking through mid February of the lake has been covered in ice and that's likely going to be a story that continues for us if we don't get these more prolonged periods of colder air and I want to show you this map because I think this shows you a really good picture of what we've been dealing with you have to look really hard to find any kind of color contours that aren't blue across Lake Erie that indicate where we've had a lot more of that ice coverage across the area so we'll see we're going to continue to monitor a lot more of this data here as we get closer to the middle to end of the month Meteorologist Jeff Tanchak, meteorologist Kelly Dobeck, they're going to have a lot more on how the rest of February could play out. Plus, looking ahead into even the early parts of April, that's all coming up tonight at 6. Meteorologist Erica Page, 19 News. Yeah, so we get to do the yep. before at 6 p.m. Are we going to change things up? Are we going to, you know, are we going to all of a sudden get a lot of snow as we get into early spring? Stay tuned. Yeah, we're, we're running out of winter, though. We're running out of winter. But we all know March can be fickle. Yeah, we've seen snow and even as April. late as May. Yes, yes, it's happened. <laughs> so. It's happened before. But in general, we'll, we'll let you know coming up at uh, 6 o'clock, Kelly and I.